Good morning. Welcome to Pine Notes. My name is Lisa and today is January 30th, 2016. And for those of you who are new, welcome. I am a beginner crocheter having two years under my belt this past December 2016. In 2016 I also started my very first YouTube channel in March for beginner crocheters like myself who need a little explanation on pattern stitches and I recently found a new stitch to me and a new stitch to many of my followers on Instagram. So if you're not already over there, please visit at Lisa Pine Notes on Instagram. And I will also uh, link that below. Today I am working on a wonderful baby cardigan from Lion Brand. It is a free pattern and it is L6. 0007 and the stitch I will be talking about today is the extended two together so that's ESC the number two and TOG now that stands for extended single crochet two stitches together I could find no information on this particular stitch and did some research. Even Lion Brand has a glossary. I did not find it there. So putting the two stitches together, what that really means is it's an extended single crochet. That's one part of the stitch. And it is a crochet two together. So it is really two stitches and one long explanation and it's so easy and fun to do. Now I will tell you for this particular pattern I did go down a hook size. I am using a size F hook which is a 5 or in UK terms it would be a 3.75 millimeter. So whether you use this stitch in this particular pattern, I just think it's fun. It is beautiful. Beautifully done. It looks wonderful. This is the back of the baby cardigan. The yarn I am using is ice cream yarn by Lion Brand and the color is in Tutti Frutti. It is 100% acrylic, it is very soft, machine washable, and it is considered a number two, which is a fine weight crochet. And you guys know from my crochet handkerchiefs, if you're a longtime subscriber of mine, and if you're not, please hit subscribe now. I love the finer crochets, I really do, and this baby cardigan here is just a super way to express that and this wonderful tutti frutti is the pop of color we need today in Ohio it is a snowy day so what we're going to do is the basis and I'll do a couple with you here extended single crochet two stitches together are really two stitches work together your extended single crochet and then the two stitches together where if you're a beginner crocheter that's your increases and decreases in a hat for example when you would crochet two stitches together so what you're going to do is insert your crochet hook in the next stitch and this draw up a loop and yarn over so what you're going to do is basically at the top of your stitch here you're going to draw up a loop yarn over pull through draw up another loop yarn over pull through and then all the hooks together with all three here this so these would be your extended single crochet 
and drawing them together like this is your two stitches together. Let's do that one more time. In the pattern it tells us to chain one so we'll do that first. We are doing a single crochet in the top of this stitch, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over again for the extension, go in again on your next stitch which in this case is the chain one space, draw up a loop, yarn over, draw up a loop, you have three, and to me these look like tiny little sun salutations when you do yoga. Like you've got your hands here and they're reaching towards the sky, those are your little hands right there, and then the last half of this extended single crochet two stitches together is to place the stitches together just by drawing through all the loops on your hook and this pattern happens to call us to do a single crochet after that. So one more time for the extended single crochet portion of this long explanation. Three loops on your hook. Here's your two hands reaching up towards the sky and pull through again. This is a beautiful stitch and as you can see in the baby sweater here it is just gorgeous, soft and simple. I went ahead and chained one. Insert your hook, draw up a loop, make the hands reaching for the sky, yarn over, draw up a loop, You've got your two hands here reaching for the sky and the crochet together is simply drawing through all those loops on your hook and this pattern calls for a single crochet after that. Once you get going this works up so fast, so quick and easy. I absolutely am enjoying this beautiful stitch, this beautiful pattern. It's a touch of spring today in Ohio. We're expecting one to four inches of snow. Make your single crochet. You've got your two hands there and the last half of that is to join them together. So two stitches together, our pattern calls for a single stitch after that. So again a single crochet in the top of the row, pull up a loop, make your single crochet, there's your hand, and again pull up a loop, your two single crochets are there with their extensions. And the top of this again. Getting into a color change here. Make your single crochet. And, and another one. Two loops on the hook. Pull through both. And there you go. This is a beautiful, beautiful pattern. I hope you guys enjoy your day. I thank you, as always, for liking, watching, and subscribing to my channel. This is Lisa from Pine Notes. Take care, make it a great day, and let's crochet. Goodbye, everybody.